The French champions, including superstar Kylian Mbappe, found the atmosphere and intensity on and off the pitch just too much as Eddie Howe's side secured a richly deserved win in Newcastle's first home game in Europe's elite competition since a 2-0 defeat to Barcelona in March 2003. The Toon Army had already transformed St. James Park into four walls of black and white even before Miguel Almiron sent them wild by giving him a 17th-minute lead after PSG keeper Gianluigi Donnarumma could only palm out Alexander Asak's shot, as Marquinhos was punished for carelessly conceding possession. It was to prove an eventful night for Italy keeper Donnarumma, who tried in vain to claw out Dan Burns' towering header six minutes before half-time. The ball had already crossed the line, but Newcastle still had to wait for a video assistant referee check for offside before the celebrations could begin. Donnarumma was a central figure again as Newcastle went three up five minutes after the break, the goalkeeper's poor attempt at a block allowing Sean Longstaff's powerful shot from an angle to creep in. PSG's threats were rare, but they did pull one back after 56 minutes through Lucas Hernandez's header, but this was Newcastle's night from start to finish. Swiss centre-back Fabian Schaar added the icing on the cake in stoppage time as he curled a stunning shot past Donnarumma from the edge of the box into the top corner to make it 4-1. The three points, added to an opening draw away to AC Milan, mean Newcastle go top of Group F.